G'day viewers, I had a question from a viewer that was trying to use a custom 442 livery, the BR442 from Germany, on Bakerloo and couldn't do it. So I thought I'd give it a try. So I've created a teal 442 and we're going to create a service now in, uh, in uh, Bakerloo. So off the rails is on, so we'll be able to pick the 442 and we're gonna add a new service. I don't really care where it starts, it doesn't matter. We'll go there, that's fine. And we'll stop there, that's also fine. And we'll stop there and there and there and there and all good. Now comes the fun bit, adding the train. So we wanna add the 442. There we go, there's the talent two. And we'll choose a loaded one and there's our teal 442 so this is where you select the livery that you want to use so we chose the 442 we chose the formation and now we can choose the livery and there we go we've got a teal livery on bakerloo so that's how you go about doing it so let's just do that one more time Let's make another train and let's go from, oh, Elephant and Castle southbound siding. That sounds like fun. Hope it's long enough. To Wealdstone, why not? And we'll stop at Embankment, wherever that is. And we'll do these passenger stops because we're never actually going to play this. Yep, that's fine. Confirm service and let's add a 442. So we choose the 442. We choose the formation, four loaded, which has got passengers in it. And we can choose between the default livery and the one I made called Teal 442. Confirm selection. Blah, blah. And there we go. Now we've got two Teal 442s on Bakerloo. So that's all there is to it. It is relatively simple. The only place I can think of someone might be getting unstuck is not realizing you need to choose the formation and then the livery. So hope that helps you. Let me know if it doesn't. Chuck it in the comments. And let's go. I think that's about the end of this video. Thanks a lot. See you later.